Hello everybody and welcome back to The Teller's Principle 2 which uh, had a DLC come out quite a while ago uh, I'm about to get around to playing it finally um, Those of you who watched my uh, original set of videos for The Teller's Principle 2 will know that I 100%ed it and I also had a pretty rough time <laughs> I liked many of the puzzles. I, I liked almost all of the puzzles, I think, uh, like the main actual puzzle things. Um, I really, the, the story and particularly Byron, I found extremely grating. Uh, and uh, some, of the, some of the kind of like searching the environment for secrets was, some of it was good and some of it was a horrible pain. Uh, <laughs> That's my that's my um, review of the of the, the base game. Let's find out if the DLC is similar, or I've I've heard there's going to be interesting like harder puzzles in the DLC. I don't know how much narrative and such there is, uh, and weirdly it's split into three things. I don't know what that means. Okay, so Orpheus ascending. Take your brain for a ride through the laser grid and explore the philosophy of love, death, and resurrection with Hypatia and Sarabai. The classic laser mechanic sort of. Yeah, the classic laser mechanics of the series are pushed to the limit in unexpected ways, testing your ability to think differently. Okay, cool. Embark on a puzzle-driven adventure set on a stunning Caribbean island, solving an array of fresh medium difficulty puzzles. Medium difficulty, culminating in the hexahedron, which is probably that bit at the end. Uh, sorry, the bit in the picture. Return to one of the most dramatic moments from the Task Force Build 2 while being challenged with extremely difficult puzzles. <laughs> These descriptions are weird. <laughs> But sure. Um, okay, I guess we'll do them in order. New game. Yeah, it's, it's weird. They each have their own separate save file as well. If a thing loves, it is infinite. William Blake. One of the things I found painful in the the base story was the the over reliance on but love, because love. This thing must be true. Or this, like, yeah. Ah, <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, all my negative feelings are coming back. <laughs> my negative feeling isn't about love. My negative feeling is about the way it was used to make the game's points, which I found frustrating. All right, I think that's it. The new body's ready for the transfer. How's the reassembly algorithm? Done. Well then, somebody just needs to go in there and disentangle the data. Ah, and here comes our expert. Thank you for agreeing to this one, Kay. Perhaps together we can right an old wrong. <laughs> when I was lost in my own grief, I spent a lot of time thinking about Hypatia and Cerebi. How they found each other. I forgot who they, they are. Each other. <laughs> And how beautiful it would be if we could reunite them. For the longest time, it was only a daydream, but not anymore. In the myth of Orpheus, the ancient bard descends into the underworld to bring back his beloved wife, who died in a tragic accident. With the power of his music, he convinces Hades and Persephone to free her. But he is told that she must walk behind him, and he must not look back at her until they have left the underworld. And so, of course, in every version of the myth, he looks back. Because he doesn't trust the gods, or because he is an imperfect man, or because he simply forgets. And death is triumphant once again. We've accepted that triumph for a long time, because we had to, because what else could we do? But the world changes, and we are not the frightened, powerless creatures we once were. Perhaps it's time to say enough, and let Orpheus complete his ascent. Okie dokie. Back into VR land. Okay. You will have to collect all of Cerebi's data fragments mm -hmm. so that we can reconstruct her personality. So we're doing another one of these you from here, memory dives. 
Good, yeah. Luck, kiddo. Yes, we did this with. I don't remember any characters' names. We did this with the 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 daughter, right? Um, like a similar thing. Uh, sorry, spoilers for the Test Principle Two. <laughs> um, but why are you watching this if you haven't watched me play, or if you haven't played it yourself? Uh, anyway, okay, let's just head out here. Yep, things are glitchy. That's how things work when you're in this virtual space. Uh, we've got. These again. Welcome to the internal messaging system, version 0.4. User Sarabai, you have three unread messages. Does this work? Oh. Cannot access, not goodbye. Okay. Open message, not goodbye. From Hypatia to Sarabai, not goodbye. I don't know what, the, what this is. I don't know why I'm writing this. In all likelihood, you can't even read this because so little of your consciousness is left and what's left of your battery is dying. They say it's impossible to recover you and the backups were all destroyed. I wish we'd backed ourselves in, up in New Jerusalem before we left, but space was so limited and we would have had to wait so long. Except of course, it's nothing compared to the empty years that stretch before me now. I don't have the words to express what you mean to me. I tried to sum it all up to say something elegant and beautiful and perfect, and I can't. And maybe it can't be said. Maybe it only exists as days and years live together, a sequence of moments bound together like a string of lights defying the darkness of the sky. I don't know. All I know is that this is not goodbye. It may be the end of you, of us, of who I was, but I will not say goodbye. Love you forever, Hypatia. Welcome to the internment. Okay, we're back here. Old messages. Okay. Right. So saying goodbye to somebody who's, I guess, in effect dying. Um... The funny thing about this game is that it's, it is like wonderfully written, and, and uh, you know it can hit on like emotional moments. It's the same in the first game, um, and yeah, I'm kind of wondering if because I really enjoyed the story in Road to Gehenna, and I wonder if I'll end up enjoying this story more than the base game here. Um, but yeah, I think I, I was just particularly frustrated with the. Um, the kind of philosophical arguments that were being made and how and how one-sided they all felt and like not only did I not agree with them in many cases in some places I did agree with them but not only did I not agree with them but I felt like they were being argued in a really not amazing way um, anyway this is not the base game anymore <laughs> It's just all coming back to me, so I'm, I'm thinking about it. Uh, okay, lots of puzzles, 16. I mean, there were probably 16 circles. Oh, there's probably 16 circles in the top left of my screen right now. Okay, one. Hello. Okay, at least there's not much wandering to get to the puzzles. Oh, hello. I've got these again. There is no greater joy than discovering something that you had never imagined. In that moment, you understand the world is better than it seems. Okay, what's happening? Yield. Oh, gosh, I've got to remember mechanics. Inverter. Oh no, what are the mechanics of this game? <laughs> so this is a... Oh gosh, oh gosh, okay. So this is a purple field. I can't take stuff through that. Can I connect stuff through that? Yes, I can. Okay. Um, what am I trying to do? Trying to get in there. That's your data fragments, I guess. Uh, blue there, red there. There is a red source. There's a red... Oh, no, that's a red target. And there's blue there. What does this do? Is that keeping that on? It's doing nothing. What is that doing? Oh no, we have the... There's no cable problem. Is it just also connected to this? It seems unlikely because there's two next to this. And those are very clearly connected to it. What is this doing? Is this thing around here? Hmm. Or oh, maybe it's doing nothing and it exists purely to uh, to get in the way. And this can't come through to the other side. Okay, first puzzle, we're stuck. Um, well, all I can connect to is that. This can't go over. Uh, oh, is this just something about, like, me blocking this? But then... How do things, like... Won't these clash again? Mm, for a moment they don't, but they do eventually. Yeah, that kind of disappears. 
Um, so do I have another idea? Could I just run? No. <laughs> uh, Alright, what are we doing? Yeah, it's tricky, like, also thinking, like, oh, do I even remember what the mechanics are in this game? And, like, trying to get back into the thought processes you need. Uh, so that's that's going there. That's the only way for me to get blue, is from that. That is staying on that side. I don't really understand what this thing is doing. Yeah, because clearly those are only required for that. It must just be to get in the way. Okay, so then how can this not be in the way? Well, that could be higher up somewhere, or... I mean, it's not just something silly like that, right? Like, what if this is, like, on there? Oh, it falls off, sadly. Uh, there's a hint thing, which I never used in the base game, but... Who knows? No, that's at the same height all the way along. Okay... So if these clash again, we have a problem. Is there some way to have... Oh, yes, I think I see. I think I see. So we connect you to both of them. Yeah. There we go. Cool. Cool. As long as the puzzles are good, I'm going to be happy. Is that true? <laughs> I don't I know. Born, the first thing I felt was that I was alone. Not that I was lonely, but that I was separate singular there was the world and there was myself a contained entity and this sense of separation of a distinct self was delightful individuality itself was a source of constant joy and wonder what could be more incredible than to be able to say i am these things are still a thing I've inserted some code that might help you bypass a few puzzles. It's not the most elegant work I've ever done, but it'll do the job. Anybody want to go put this in a hex to ASCII converter? I'm assuming that's what it will be. Uh, okay. There's a weirdly small entrance to puzzle two, crossing the river. We have a connector. We have a blue source. We have a red source. It's about to catch up. <laughs> um, <laughs> target here. Target there. Are those targets that don't do anything like in the previous one? Maybe. Uh, connector. Blue. Okay. So it's, it's a similar setup, but with three things in the way. So we are connecting. The, uh, we only technically need one of these to do this. If I were also connected to that and that, what would happen? Oh, I'm in the way. That can get through there. Now, with the other one, can I block the next two? What if we connect to you? Ooh. Uh, maybe, or to you, and then to that, and then to that? Ah, you need blocking on that side. Okay, that feels doable though. If I also do... Oh no, but then I'm going to get in the way. Right, so that needs, to, that needs to be blocked on that side. So they always need to be blocked on the side of the, the emitter source so so if you're gonna be over here then you'll probably want to connect to uh, that that would block both of those and then you block <laughs> oh my gosh this kind of thing always ends up being hard to wrap your head around. That's not blocking anything, because it was also connected to this, I think? Ah, okay. So that... That... That's at least blocking that one. And then... 
Can I reconnect you to that? I think I need, right? Uh, oh, and you're not currently connected to this, but if you were, we'd be done. <laughs> so I might, do I need to reset anything up? It's hard to keep track of the like states that you're going through. No, we're good. All right, cool. Like because you're like, it's 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 quite confusing to keep track of like what's blocking what and what's, uh, especially when you're also seeing those like intermediate stages where things are passing through and then they disappear. It's a bit like oh gosh, things just changed. What's actually blocking what now? I have no idea. Anyway, this works. Let's let's move on with our lives. Okay. Okay, so so far, puzzle heavy, story minimal. I realized that the more I developed this sense of self, the more enjoyable it became simply to exist. It wasn't selflessness that improved existence, mm. but refinement of the self. When the ancients said that ego is something to set aside, they got it all wrong. Ego is something to nourish and shape. It's like a face. A work of art. The reconstruction's working. Keep going, 1K. I shall. Uh, okay. What's going on here? There's a purple field there, a purple field there. So that's walk throughable. There's a button here that opens that. It's a blue gate, which blocks uh, lasers. Purple again. Blue that is just here to get in the way. It looks like. Maybe. You. You store stuff. That's how you work. You can store a, a laser beam inside you. Okay, so it's a similar setup as in there's like a thing to get in the way. This is never coming out of here. Which is interesting. I guess that means this is necessary. And then what's connecting to you? What do I actually need for the end here? Oh, red. Only red. So I need you. So seemingly I'd want to do something like this. But then also the, get the blue out of the way. Okay, so the blue emitter is on this side. Okay, so I want you to be connected to that as well. To this. Okay, now you've got red and we're done. Yay! It's a funny little animation. My insights into the value of the self were genuine, I think. But of course, I was completely inexperienced. In fact, in many ways, I was like a human child. So I began to resent everything that intruded on that sense of self. My social obligations to the others, the leadership of Athena and Cornelius, even the obvious limitations imposed on us by our situation. Why did I have to exist in this particular historical moment? Saddled with the task of reconstructing civilization. Recover peace. TTP. It's it like PPT PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> An ethical philosophy of life. Felix Adler. Was that name in the base game? I don't remember. User highlighted. It is upon. It is upon those we love that we must anchor ourselves spiritu spiritually in the last moments. The sense of interconnectedness with them stands out vividly by way of contrast at the very moments when our mortal connection with them is about to be dissolved. And the intertwining of our life with theirs, the living in the life that is in them, is, a, is but a part of our living in the infinite manifold of the spiritual life. The thought of this as apprehended, not in terms of knowledge, but in immediate experience, begets the peace that passeth understanding. It is upon the bosom of that peace that we can pass safely out of the realm of time and space. Or is Felix Adler a, a, a real name that I should be aware of, maybe? Recover God. Okay, just recovering God here. First series, Ralph Waldo Emerson. User highlighted. Thus we are thus are we put in training for a love which knows not sex, not person, sorry, nor person, nor person 
nor po- blah, 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 blah. Thus we are put in training for a love which knows not sex, nor person, nor partiality, but which seeks virtue and wisdom everywhere, to the end of increasing virtue and wisdom. We are by nature observers, and thereby learners. That is our permanent state, but we are often made to feel that our affections are but tents of a night. Though slowly and with pain, the objects of the affections change, as the objects of, of thought do. There are moments when the affections rule and absorb the man and make his happiness dependent on a person or persons. With health, the mind is presently seen again, its overarching vault, bright with galaxies of immutable lights and the warm loves and fears that swept over us as clouds, must lose their finite character and blend with God to attain their own perfection. It's, uh, I'm having the problem of reading and also taking in. It's quite like reading out loud and also taking in is a little tricky. Um, Eternity. In what uh, Theo Erkenwald? In what sense I, am I a Christian then, if I care so little for dogma? In the sense that in everything I do and think, I follow the revelation of Jesus Christ. The greatest of all things is love. Love is the nature of God, and so equally the nature of that which was created in His image. This I have learned through the revelation that is daily life, through toil and misery and strife, and that infinite power that. Uh, and that infinite power which brings relief and joy. Thus I reject those who believe that the ordinary love of mortal beings is limited and that it ends with death. Rather, it is through love that we perceive the immortality of the soul, for it, for it reveals that eternity is conceivable to the human mind when it is filled with love. It is because we know that we can love another forever that we know... For, it is because we know that we can love... An, what? It is because we know that we can love another forever that we know that we are in we are the children of god okay <clears throat> i don't have much time left i never thought it would end this way oh he's an incorruptible hawk after emails i don't have much time left i never thought it would end this way never thought i would die alone sitting around in my apartment wondering if things would have gone differently if we'd gotten that stupid grant mostly though i just wonder why we're not together i still don't understand I don't know why you had so much pain inside you. I don't know why you let it infect everything we had. I don't know why you couldn't see my love for you, why you twisted everything I said. I was angry and disappointed for so long, but now I just wish I could have found some way to make that pain go away. I would give anything to that. I wish you were here. Interesting. What's the context behind this? Is, is this like a real world email referencing back to the events in Taz Principle 1? Maybe? Uh... Although well, maybe not. I don't know. Um, okay. Four. Fastness. Hey, connector. Connector. Red, red. So I can get that other connector. I mean, why would just do that, right? It's basically free. Is there anything else to note in this room? This is the missing polygon on the wall. I think? Curious. Uh, okay, so I've got this. I can see through here. Does that open that? It does open that, okay. Now, where am I trying to go? I'm trying to go here. Blue required, blue is here. Blue is visible if this is open. This could connect across and it could block that at the same time, is that what we're doing? We no longer need this. I think that might be what we're doing. We're just, yeah, we're just doing this, right? Oh, no, it's the other way around, okay but still basically the same. Okay, weirdly simple puzzle. There's like a little bit of a setup for it, but the setup was simple. And then once you get to the, the actual puzzle, it's like the same as the Without previous puzzle. focus on the self, also came an enormous and increasingly overwhelming fear of death. The pleasure of existence seemed almost erased by the possibility of its ending. 
If it was possible not to be, if the self had an ending, even in the distant future, then how could anything have meaning? I spent far too much time imagining that last moment, the moment just before I stopped existing. How could I possibly face that? I, I, I don't quite understand the leap from if self has an ending, then how can it? I mean, I mean, I mean, yeah. I find, I guess, all like conversations about meaning, the meaning of life, are a little bit like. <laughs> I mean, what do you mean by meaning? What's the meaning of meaning? Uh, this tree looks weirdly suspicious. Can I, can I jump on here? No, 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 no. That was more of a task principle one thing. Let's, we're not doing that here. Uh, it suddenly became a very large environment. Oh. <laughs> Did the music just happen to end at, the, at that moment? <laughs> I think it might have done. Okay, back up there we go. Okay, so there's a chasm in the middle. There's a little flame thing here. Hello. Those are just to do the like the puzzle skipping, aren't they? I don't think I ever used them before. I've ended up basically going down to the other area, haven't I? Yeah, that's nine, ten, etc. Okay, five, six, seven, eight. Up this way, maybe. Five. And I gotta check over here. It's a good job I'm waterproof. Oh. <gasps> Turns out I just skipped a bit of stuff. That's all. Alright. Five. Chain. Okay, there's a switch. Ooh. Well, that's fun. That's certainly a setup. What on earth is going on here? Here's the ending. The ending requires... That red thing to be lit. What am I even looking at here? A bunch of blue gates. Some of them are already open. Right, because those are red lasers going to red things, opening those gates. But then we've got red lasers going to blue things. Is there a blue on the other side? There is, I see. So we want to... There's a tug of war happening here. We want, we want, we want blue to start winning, or a, I guess a, a push of war. We want blue to start winning, and then we'll be okay. And that just lowered that. Wait, I mean, is there any reason I want to? That was just for the reveal, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, sure. Um, and then we've just got this. So, do I? That's just gonna go across. So I only want to mess with this. Uh, I assume, like, you're just automatically connected to that, are you, actually? I don't know if that's true. No, you're, no, you're not, because we'd see it. Okay. Okay, so I'm connecting to you, and then... What happens if I do this and this? How did you end up connecting to that? Did I do that by mistake? I think I did. Oh, I can't connect. Oh, that's behind. There's like a glass pane there. Ah! <laughs> I left the puzzle. <laughs> Wait, so if I just do this, this won't work, right? Because... Well, I don't know exactly. Well, apparently that gives us one more blue to the left. Which I guess I don't want. And what's the logic behind that? Like, why don't they collide there? I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't, shouldn't question it too much and should just do this. Although... Ooh, it always gets to there. Maybe I'm going to have to question it. It doesn't always get to there. Okay, it's almost like it wants me to connect to multiple. What's, what's the effect of doing that? Let's just do those two. 
Like, aren't they always going to collide at a thing? Therefore, one of them is going to be off and closed. What's the logic here? Like, why there? It's two away from this. Why are you happy overriding the red laser at that one, but not at that one? Is it a distance thing? One, two, three, four, five. Uh, one, one two, three, four, five. It's a distance thing, isn't it? Okay. <clears throat> so, if I want the collision to be there, that's after one, two, three, four, five. One, no, one, two, three, four. So I want this to be the fifth, right? So don't I just connect to the next one, fourth one along? Is that right? Yes. <laughs> okay. It really wants me to understand the logic of how things collide. Okay. Distances. I'd kind of forgotten, but it, it kind of came back to me as I was solving it. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Looking back, it's embarrassing how solipsistic I became. I really thought that I could construct my identity without any reference to the outside world. Like I could just will myself into existence. But it just didn't work. And it made me miserable. Everything felt hollow and meaningless. Overshadowed by the idea of death. There was something I wasn't seeing. Something I needed, but I couldn't figure out what it was. Sarabai, what you're missing is that you just need to enjoy life. <laughs> Stop overthinking things. <laughs> you're you're ruminating. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. <clears throat> so these are already charged, but we could replace them if we want to. And this is where we get our energy from. This is purple. There's a connector here, bunch of connectors. Okay, so probably a similar setup then. Yeah, this is all about counting. How do we even connect to those though? Oh, I guess there is a gap there and there's a gap on the other side, all right. Okay, and we use these to do the maths, all right. <clears throat> so we, I don't think we are discharging these, I guess. So the maths, is so on the red side we have one two three four of them forced well five of them forced well no not not really four of them forced and then on this side we've got one two so i think we want uh both of these over here I didn't double check my working. That appears to be correct. Yay. <clears throat> I can count. Alrighty, that was good progress. Everything changed when we started spending more time with each other. Do you remember that night when we found the old library in the Dead City? It was just after the stampede, and we were all a bit shaken up. Byron read to us Ugh, from one of the Byron. books. Byron. You and I started arguing about one of the poems, and your perspective was so different and interesting, and I just kept wanting to hear more. Something has gone wrong. We are fragmented. This is incorrect. Who are you for? Alrighty, yes. Good progress. Uh, is that... A third of the puzzles done? Wait, how many were there? 16? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Wait, how many are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. There are 16. And we've done 6. Okay. Just over a third then. Just, just over a third. 
Uh, alrighty. So, yeah, next time I'll see you for some more of these puzzles. Oh gosh, walking into trees. Um, yeah, the, I mean, the puzzles are good. I, and I, it's got a similar thing to Road to Gehenna where um, like they feel like really focused puzzles on a particular idea. There was definitely like one already that I was a bit like, I'm not sure, really sure that felt necessary. It kind of feels like they needed to have four related to that, that premise from the previous uh, set of four. Um, and so they just had an extra on the end that didn't really feel like it did anything special. But um, otherwise, though, I'm enjoying the, the focus, like the focus on counting for these two at least. I assume that's going to continue for the next two. Um, and yeah, the focus on like blocking lasers with other lasers on in, in the previous set. Alrighty, folks. Uh, see you next time. And we shall continue in that direction. Is it that direction? It wasn't a six, it was seven. I don't know. I, I think I saw it earlier. We'll, we'll figure that out next time. Right. Goodbye.